You're going to meet someone who is very young and proof that every person in every family has the light of genius in them. Sometimes all you need is an inspiring reason. This is the story of one boy who loves science, a sick family friend, and something he did that could make all the difference. Here's ABC's Dr. Richard Besser. The winner in the category of medicine and health sciences. If someone is going to cure cancer, I think it might be this guy. A Maryland ninth grader, Jack Andreka, who just won $100,000 in the Intel Science Prize. His invention? A little piece of paper, a test that detects the very beginnings of cancer. It's 168 times faster and 400 times more sensitive than current tests. And it costs just three cents. It could detect the cancer before it becomes invasive. You catch them early. Yeah, so that's what's so cool about the test to me. Jack's an average teenager in a lot of ways. You know. But he's loved science since he was three. And when his family lost a friend to pancreatic cancer, it made him think of tiny carbon molecules. Carb it's carbon nanoparticles? Carbon nanotubes. Carbon nanotubes. Did you learn about carbon nanotubes in school? No, I actually read a bunch of journal articles just for fun. That's my cup of tea. Dr. Anubhan Maitra of Johns Hopkins agreed to let Jack spend the summer in his lab. He thinks Jack is in pretty amazing company. Gates, Zuckerberg, Steve Jobs. So how does it work? When yes, you have some cancers, so your body produces a particular protein. Jack's test looks for that protein. The impact of this could be huge. You can use it for infectious diseases. You just swap out whatever it's detecting. So simple. And now medical companies will be scrambling to try Jack's test on real patients. Andreka. Andreka. Remember that name. Makes you wonder what he'll do when he's 16. Dr. Richard Besser, ABC News, Baltimore, Maryland.